Here's what happens when we experience a moment of stress. The body tenses, the breathing becomes shallow. There is a decrease in oxygen. The brain senses the rising CO2. Breathing gets faster. Mind starts racing. The heart rate speeds up. The sympathetic nervous system goes into overdrive. Stress hormones are released and the vicious cycle continues. Breathing properly as well as certain breathing techniques can diffuse your brain's alarm system by adjusting your oxygen levels. And this will help stop the anxiety from escalating. Activating your parasympathetic nervous system by breathing through your nose can help you regain a sense of calm and break that cycle. Also, decreasing the amount of air you take in and doing small breath holds after you exhale can help rebalance the O2 CO2 ratio in the blood. These things have been proven to work, but you need to do them properly and be your own best teacher by reflecting on how the techniques are working for you. Terry B, a working professional in her 60s, says, Today's practice was so informative and educational. While we were practicing breathing slowly, but taking in less air, I felt balanced, light, calm, almost like my upper body was floating above my lower body. It was a delicious feeling. So take it from Terry, and we're gonna head into the breathing room so that you can feel your delicious breath and savor this amazing practice. And welcome to my breathing room. I hope that you have created a beautiful breathing space for yourself, a small little slice of peace and a beautiful tranquil sanctuary, even if it's just a little corner of the room. Today, we're gonna to practice the send breath. This breath is the cornerstone of breathing properly. And upon completing this course, you will understand exactly why this kind of breathing is so important. 